it might be the perfect job for you. Learn more on the ITD website. Scott Dorval with your Idaho News 6 forecast. Well, if you're new to the area, we could certainly use more plows on the road when it snows. So be prepared for the potential for not having a plow on your road, certainly in subdivisions. But on the main roads, they'll clear them, but it's going to take some time. So we'll have to be patient this winter. Not snowing just yet, but it's uh, coming. 61 degrees right now. The village at Meridian wind is on the light side. It is comfortable outside, but certainly cooler with the cloud cover and 10 degrees cooler than yesterday. We're feeling the chill in the air. A lot of cloud cover in McCall today. Look at this forecast for the entire week ahead. A 90% chance of rain tomorrow starting around, say, midday to 2 in the afternoon, maybe closer to 2. We'll get a chance of some rain coming in in 3 and 4, definitely. Then it clears out much cooler. 45 Thursday, beautiful on Saturday. Saturday at 57 and then later on Sunday rain comes in and look at this temperature drop to a high of 40 on Monday could even be some more snow showers on Monday into Tuesday so much colder weather coming in and the higher elevations will start to see some snow so we have this cold front go through yesterday that is pushing off to the east right now and then just a lot of cloud cover streaming across southern Idaho we've cooled down a little bit everything's shifting to the south a little but there's a cold front a disturbance that's moving rapidly it's well off of our screen it's going to come tracking through for tomorrow Tomorrow evening and so here's what it looks like on the future cast. We've got the high clouds still hanging around. I think they're going to thicken during the day tomorrow, but look at the time here. This is six o'clock tomorrow evening. This is 24 hours from now. In fact, 25 hours from now and that frontal system is just approaching. I think we're going to get some gusty wind just ahead of this gusting 25 to 35 miles per hour just before the rain comes in and then there'll be rain coming in with it. Now from a call, it'll be a little bit earlier than that, but the western valley around this time tomorrow and then and coming through the valley, Treasure Valley, and this could be a moderate rain coming down at least a tenth of an inch, maybe a little bit more, comes through in a couple of hours, and then it starts to clear right on out behind it, and so it dries out, we'll get more sunshine, but cooler during the day on Thursday. Computer chart showing up, it's through a quarter inch in Boise. If we cut that in half, which sometimes is what you need to do with some of these models, that would put us down to a little over 10. I'm thinking we'll get about 13 hundredths of an inch of moisture, so that's pretty good. It's going to come through wet your grass, certainly, as it moves through, but watch the wind here. Not not too much and all of a sudden there's the cold front coming through with wind gusts that could go over 35 maybe even 40 in a couple of open areas so gusty wind with some uh, and then rain comes in then the wind will settle down and we'll get some snow in the mountains this is from the frontal system for tomorrow night and you see here the higher peaks one to three inches of snow out of this system but I want to fast forward because we're going to see a bit of a change in the weather pattern and a couple of big storms are going to come in and look at this we could be seeing again above 7500 feet you hunters get ready We've got a chance for some significant snow next week as colder air moves on in. So we see the system tomorrow rapidly racing to the east here and then watch what happens. Warm air comes in for Saturday. It looks kind of nice and then we get a big trough of cold low pressure and another huge trough potentially coming in behind it. And so this is going to be a big drop in temperature where Boise may see barely a high of 50 when that cool air moves in. So for the Treasure Valley tomorrow, dry through most of the day, but in the evening when you head off to work, everything's fine work or school coming home fine from school but in the evening uh, could be some rain falling in the western valley around five or six o'clock and by seven o'clock it's approaching the Ada Canyon County line here's my extended forecast now for the Treasure Valley 62 tomorrow about 53 on Thursday a chilly day a beautiful day I've got a Scott score of a nine on Saturday that's my pick day after some sixes and sevens but look at this 50 degrees a Scott score of a four by next Tuesday